Do you find your mind in a confusing state? Not sure really what to feel and what to say and what to think. So if I can come along and help you out with this now, because all you've got to do is listen, listen now. Because I've said lots of things to you, and now you can enjoy all those things brand new. Because I can tell you. Hello, and welcome to Muso Confuso. Have you been confused by songs that you've heard recently? Don't worry, I'm here to help you identify what the confusion might be. So first of all, there's been some mild controversy, or possibly controversy, controversy, Contro- controversy, controversy. There's been a bit of a muddle about a certain song that's been around for ages. I think we all know which one it is. But it's not the one by Orville and Keith Harris. Now that one was quite naughty. Um, the song we're talking about is the one that relates to brown sugar not being about, well, sugar being about something altogether a little bit more uh, dodgy. I thought it was about drugs. How come it feels so nice because it's illicit? That's what I thought it would be, but no, it's about um, the, the S word. No, not that S word. The S word that starts with S and ends with lavery. And uh, it's all about that sort of thing. And I have danced quite often to that uh, song at weddings and at parties. And suddenly I thought, oh my goodness, I'm saying we should do the S lavery word. And we should never have done it in the first place. So there you go. Because that song is so old. It's how old? 1970. Oh. Well, anyway, so, you know, some 70s things are here to stay, like what my fashion is. But uh, if you ever hear a song like that ever again, remember, don't dance to it. Or, I don't know, change the words to being about sugar. And don't be euphemistic. It's very naughty. Because I can tell you what not to do and what not to not to say. Because we're going to start doing that today or yesterday. Because the future is beckoning out. And say, come on, you can't do that now, but you can do this now. How confusing. Thank you.